Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Mario and Luigi Partners in Time. Well, it's been a wild ride through the Baby Bowser's castle. Let's go see what Professor Egad wants. And just like that, we are back at our own time. Yes, we noticed. Thank you very much, Stuffwell. Let's hustle five uh, over and see the good professor. Yeah, just doing that myself. You're sure we're shut up! I know how to use a freaking map! Shut the hell up! Have I is there anything back here? Yes there is! Let's check it out. One I'm sure cool. And ten coins. Sweet. Alright, now let's get back to the good old prof. Yeah, I don't know why I went that way. Get out of the way, Toad! And while we're here... Yeah, that's what that heart block does. It heals everything. Well, everybody. Yeah, it looks like you got that shoeboid in the tube. Hey now! Back at last! Yep, we certainly are. Wild ride! Stuff will inform you that you were bringing the little fellers back with you this to this time. Yeah, we were. And look at this now, they're red and green. I am plum astounded. But then again, what else would the little fellers be wearing, huh? Well, it makes sense. <laughs> Still, it tickles me to see the little bros and teams up with the bi regular big bros. Professor, I must inform you that the Mushroom Kingdom of the past is in gargantuan trouble. Stop making up world stuff while well, you're not that clever. Hmm. So it's true. These shrimp creatures have made off of the princess, eh? Unless stuff has been updating you exactly what the shrimps are, uh, you should not really know what these things are. You gotta do something about the princess, man! Hmm. Oh, I shouldn't have mentioned, Professor. We've covered this at Bowser's Castle in the past. Oh, yeah, the little t pyramid thing. I feel ashamed that I cannot identify it. I have no similar records in my database. Yowzer! That's a cobalt star shard! The time machine's fuel source! No kidding! Cool! Was it Bowser's castle? And how did it get broken? Yeah, that's a mystery. What's going on? Whoa! Good gravy! The Cobot Star is driving that monster crazy! Yeah, we can see that! Aw, oh, poor little Luigi. Hmm... Could it be? Yep, it could. I do believe there is a link between the Cobalt Star and the Shroom Marauders. Really cool. Maybe we can figure out how to defeat these alien jerks if we collect more Star Shards. You're kind of assuming a lot there, Toad. Possibly. Mario, you gotta do it! Find the other stars and rescue the princess! Yeah, we'll do what we can, we, but it's, there's absolutely no guarantee that it'll, we will actually succeed if we do so. Oh, yeah. And what's it doing? And somehow it's showing the way there! Even though it, it isn't really sentient. That's shaking! It's not natural. I wager a new time hole is open here in the castle. Yeah, we can see there, uh, right on the map. That cobalt shard, star shard is reacting to other shards that are scattered in the past. How so, exactly? Mario, Luigi, 
you youngsters get going to find those other cobalt star shards. Sure thing, Prof. Oh, and by the way, if you care to check out the cobalt star shard, just a lot of stuff out of the screens, blah blah blah, you can check your progress, blah blah blah. There's a fair chance that there's a new that this new uh, time hub will lead you to more shards. Why don't you jump on in and head back to the Mushroom Kingdom of the past? Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh wait, before you go, I've got presents for you. Really sweet. They're badges. Yep. Items that can follow you fellers up. Cool. And badges in this game have different functions. This is, instead of um. Increasing your attack power, like they did in Superstar Saga, they actually grant you different abilities. And we know how to equip stuff. Let's give it to... Mario? Luigi, there we go. Shut up, we know. Well, I'm gonna continue my research on this alien predator. The rest is up to you boys. Okay. Oh, and by the way, the shroom shop on the castle's east side has just opened up for business. You may want to stock up on items and whatnot before hitting a, the next time hole. Alright, so let's go do that. Alright, there's the item shop and the equipment shop. Let's check out the equipment shop first. Let's get some clothing here. Uh, okay, uh, let's get a couple of each here. Yeah, we can only buy one at a time, unfortunately. Let's sell our old stuff here. Alright, that should be enough to buy more of those, uh... Pants for the little brothers. I'm just checking out the badges here. Nothing that really catches my eye right now, though. Alright. I forgot to get the, uh, the pants for the kids. So, yeah, the, the bros gets. Uh, the big bros get the slacks, and the little bros get the jeans. Okay, and here we could buy some more uh, brothers' items. Because, ooh, bro flowers and cannonballers. Cannonballers are pretty good for this early in the game, but we can only buy so many right now. And, uh, and some bro flowers will help out here. We're, we are so low on cash right now. <laughs> Okay, let's get going to the uh, time hole here. Nothing really else to do right now. Hear that? That's the sound of railroading. Alright. Nothing else is run here. Let's go in. Villain! What's. Uh oh, what's going on here? I dare say that is her! Toesworth chasing Toesworth. That child you're holding, sir? She's the princess, is she not? Oh boy. Keep your distance! You're not clear to address her royal highness! The short time she's been gone, she's grown so small! This is why I opposed to that infernal time device! <laughs> oh god! <laughs> Someone! ANYONE! PRINCESS! VILLAIN! HELP! SOMEONE! Is this castle deserted? Might as well be. PRINCESS! This 
is what I call time travel music! Toadwood Forest. A lot of mushrooms and a lot of trees. Nothing much else right now. Kinda like those veiny things there. Mushrooms, and we'll throw the babies into these. We can throw babies into the stumps and to get stuff here. Ooh, 100 coins! Awesome! Okay, let's see here. Mushroom job, cool. Alright. What's this? More bro flowers! Awesome! Alright. One coin and a hundred coins! <laughs> I am loving these stumps already! But not all of these stumps have something in them. Well, something good in them. Unless they consider random battles good. These creatures are called Koopaliums. Yeah, kind of a mix between chameleons and Koopas. Hey, but using a shell on them doesn't really work for them, on them so that's why I'm jumping on them. So let's try burning them and see what that does to them. Well, that did quite a bit. Alright, let's get to one. Are you talking to us? Mr. Mario! Mr. Mario! I am called Todiko. I was on the time machine with Princess Peach. As soon as we arrived in this time, we were attacked. A fierce alien race known as the Shroops came out of nowhere. Uh, not quite matching with your memory, huh? <laughs> yeah! Quite a pickle Peach got herself into. Who are you? Yeah, this doesn't look good. Mrs. Peach was taken by the shrooms, and I was captured by the trees of this forest. These trees, slowly but surely, siphoning so away all our mushroom power, or Vim. Yeah, I don't think Vim is a real thing. The pure Vim, then flows through the roots of the trees, deep, deep underground. It is gathered at the shrooms' Vim factory, in the heart of the forest. Rumor has it the mushroom power is somehow changed at the Vim Factory. Shit! I wonder how. It's mixed with lots of chemicals and becomes fuel for the shrimp's black saucers. Okay. Wow. How are you? You must leave me. Hasten to the Vim Factory. It's all that matters now. Somewhere in that horrible place, this Cobalt Star Star. I just know it. Really cool! The Cobalt Star and Princess Peach. Uh, 
what's going on here? Oh, crap! Good thing the troops don't really lead their shots much. And are not that... Come on, don't gather. Shit! Oh, let's check out this dump here! Stuff! Super shroom, awesome! And Luigi grabbed that right out of the air! <laughs> Continuing on! Alright, another Kupalion! The older brother's leveled up there! More stuff to check out, but first let's fight this guy! Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Boo guy! Get rid of these Kupalions first, they're gonna be kind of annoying. But he, but he pretty much know how to fight this guy already. Well, at least uh, dodge his attacks. And, uh... One of these days I'll show you how the, you can use the, um... Fire flower with the babies piggybacking the, the older brothers. Yeah, they're, the boo guys are nothing special. Although I would like to actually counter them, but whatever, they're, it's pretty easy to counter. All about time. Alright, the baby's leveled up! Dash, even though they have a distinct lack of it on on their sprites. Okay, let's. Uh, eh, that's that's okay, I guess. Okay. More stuff. Green shells. Down here. Ooh, new enemy. This is okay. Let's use a fire flower. This thing. It's a bit of last run of plan. Last of plans or whatever. I forget what. And didn't really do anything. Wow. The last of piranha. That's what it is. Let's try using a green shell. Let's see how much I can do this time. Six. Okay, I, I'm not entirely sure exactly how to uh, dodge their attacks. I believe it's dependent on how far they extend their necks. But I'm... but I'll have both of them dodge just in case. There we are! That goes... that takes care of that! Another bro flower! Nice! Place the one we wasted. In this next area, we go. We cannot go north. Yes, you saw the the trees have blocked the path. So we have no choice but to go south. See here, uh, there's. Why did I use Mario for that? I'm stupid. All right. No, nothing special over here. So let's go down over here. All right. Bunch of glass blocks with a bunch of stumps. So this is the only uh, kind of extended stump thing for the babies to go through. All we have to do is uh, uh, hit those blocks and uh, get them into those, and uh, I'll take care of the enemies around here, and then I'll show you where all the other blocks are. 
must heal up. Yeah, Baby Mario got a little bit beaten up in that last battle. Okay. This too. Yeah, nothing really special about this place. It's just a, a one big circle. So you can either go counter, uh, counterclockwise, like I'm doing, or clockwise. It doesn't really matter which way. Alright, and with that, the, the last one is just this way, beyond this last per- uh, last of Since all six of those are filled, let's reunite the two groups. Okay. Yeah, that was unnecessary. What's this? Five coins, not bad. Yeah, as you can see, all we need to do now is unite all the flames into that center portion. I personally do it that way, but you can uh, do and put them all in one at a time, and with the, with all six combined, you can clear the way. I'm surprised that the entire forest hasn't burned down. Is it on fire yet? That would make our job against the troops that much easier. But oh well. Go down here, and we're in the area in the area of the Shrew Vim Factory. So we're gonna go take care of that in the next episode, cause it's kind of a long way to actually get inside. So until next time, see you later.